ちゃんとついてこいよよし行きましょう、yeah. Yeah. Is that? Powerful anti venom. Okay, that's a dead end. <laughs> Let's go up. I don't know what they're called. Damage too, it's the most powerful attack I've seen so far. There we go. Ooh, what's that? Can't carry more items. Oh, that's not good. I'm not even at the end yet. Alright, let's see then. What do I have that's not super expensive? Slimes are worth a hundred. Alright, a hundred seems like the one of the cheaper things. Uh, I'll hold on to that for now. Slime seems really, really common. If I ever need it, I can come back and get it. Candy, plus two. It's pretty cheap too. Oh, a block. Okay, I can block things. That makes sense. I got a shield. Nice. I want to assume that only works for projectiles. Well, you know what? These guys aren't that tough. I'll just let one hit me. Especially since I'm near leveling. But I mean, this is something that... Like him. No, oh jeez. No, that's not a good idea. What's that? Chestnut. Alright, well, let's hope there's enough down here for me to level up because. Yeah, there's gotta be something down here to fight. Oh, Come on. Charm. Love it. Max, we can get them. Alright. Next floor. I'm stocked up on stuff, though. Oh, what's this? Ooh. Big treasure chest. Oh, that's a good point. I even consider it at the end of each dungeon is like some amazing treasure. Did I do it? I, I did, didn't I? Yeah, I did it! I've cleared the Hall of Trials! Oh, sweet mystery of life. Now you'll give me money. That's good. Way to go, Louie. Raquette, Tier, this is all thanks to you guys. This is all well and good, but there is a treasure chest just ahead. It behooves us to investigate thoroughly. Tier, you really do like <laughs> going for the money, don't you? What? I, do not spout such foolishness. There is no need to treat me like a flying ball of greed. <laughs> hey, hey now. I love me some treasure too. Don't worry, Tear. I feel you on this. Really? You two completely misunderstand me. So, the contents of the chest? Ha, give me just a second here. Letters. Hey. Wow, cards. So this, oh, the Adventurer's Guild card. Neat. Uh, 
Uh, here, Riquette. Take one, like we promised. Huh? Oh yeah, okay. While you did, while you did promise to give us your card eventually, we are not so crass as to demand your very first card. You really should think about who you want to give your first. No, I want this. Riquette, I beg you, please take my very first card. I'd love to. Thanks, Louis. Ah. Uh. Awesome. I can't wait to adventure with you two some more. You do realize we didn't bring any items, so he could have done this without us. You really could have. Some pe young people. Oh my goodness. Oh, what is that? Oh, it's, it's a quick way out. Hey, Tia, what's this thing that just showed up? It's a door over, Cat. We have him at our store. Ah, uh, yes, that. That is commonly referred to as a... Go... Okay. Um, what I mean, a, a door of return. If you enter that door, you can return to a town in an instant. Okay. This one has appeared because we have cleared the dungeon. But they often, but they are often encountered during normal exploration too. Okay, that makes it so you can actually return and put your items back. I believe they usually appear roughly every five levels or so. So there are some pretty big dungeons in this. Nemo. But wait, if we take this back to town when we're halfway in, don't we have to start all the way back from the beginning again? Not at all. You can always head back to the floor that had a door on it. In fact, if you do not use a door, you do have to restart. So if we find a door, we should always use it. Almost always. If if we need to rest or unload, then we, you know, we should use the door. Remember though, returning home takes time. Furthermore, leaving ends the current contract with your companion. <sighs> and we would not and we would have to rehire him or choose a new one. If there is something specific in a dungeon that you desire, you can simply ignore the doors and press onward. Alrighty then, I think we have to go home now. Quite so. Oh, just to be sure, in the future, please try to avoid referring to this as going home. Yes? Okay. What's wrong with going home? This is instinctively bash the door. Return to town now. Clear! Hooray! Alright, we got stuff. Oh wow, it took all day. Exceeded expectations. Alright, we're on a good uh We're doing pretty good. Hey Cat, may I have a moment please? Sure, what's up? Concerning the debt. I have a, I have a suggestion concerning its repayment. You do? Repaying it all back at once is wholly beyond your means. So I recommend smaller weekly payments to slowly chip away at it. <laughs> Holy beyond. Uh, you know, you, you never told me how big Papa's debt is exactly. That is because you would faint if I if you found out. For now, it is a secret. As the store begins to build up steam, we will increase payment size. Okay, the payment date nearest to the current date, along with the amount due, will be displayed on the calendar in the main menu. Please be sure to check it regularly. Okay, uh, I'll keep an eye on it. I'm actually, oh, I'm playing. That's long sword. Let's put the best stuff up front. How happy she is when she does this. Oh, these are expensive. No, I don't Alright, let's see how well this does. Look, the store is fully stocked. Hello, welcome to Reketeer. Okay, hee <laughs> hee, yay, you have it, yay. Um, let's, you know, I was making pretty good money, I think, at the 106%. Especially since it's all 100% profit. So let's see if I can't... Yep, see, 30. Oh, look at all that experience I got. Oh, look, Louis here. Hi there. Oh my goodness, yes, thank you. The mother-in-law asked for this, that is good. Near pin. I think that's like... Oh, I'm level 2. Is that the shopkeeper? The guild um, master? Anyway, 
Welcome to Rocketeer. This is a present for Daddy. Aww. So I think 106% is like what I want to be aiming for here. I hit that pretty... Well, it is kind of easy to hit. You just, it's almost always just one up on the second digit. Oh my goodness, I'm making so much money. Oh, hi. Welcome. Wow, leather armor plus one. Mommy told me to buy this. Thank you, Miss Riquet. Oh, yeah, are you a return customer already? Yay, I sold leather armor plus one for 530 picks. Are you talking to me again? Well, then, you seem to have developed a basic understanding of how to sell things to people and not drive them to burn the shop in anger. <laughs> yep, Easy Easiest pod. So much food. Being a truly great store owner involves more than selling things, however. There are times when people will want to sell items to you as well. Really? I, sus I suspect we will begin to get such offers soon. But I already buy stuff from the guild in the market, so why would I worry about buying stuff from the customers? Because we're going to buy it for about 50%. There is one major difference between a guild or market purchase and a purchase from an individual. Individuals do not have set prices. In other words, you're going to haggle as you do when selling. Haggle down, that is. Oh, so I can get stuff really cheap. So that seems like it'd be pretty hard. Fundamentally, buying and selling are not that different. The customer shows you an item they wish to sell, and then you set a price and perhaps negotiate. Obviously, you wish to pay less than the base price of the item. Okay, so buy low, sell dear, right? <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, anyway. Just so, that is <laughs> the very core of a successful business. Now then, shall we practice? Great. The fundamental procedure is the same as when selling. Kayo. Welcome to Racketeer. Would you buy this from me? I'm okay. Need to move. So I think press down, obviously. You know what? I know the target for an actual shop is 50%. Yes. This is a good price level. Now then, let us practice haggling over the price a little. The concept is essentially the same as selling something. Now that you have offered a price you believe to be fair, adjust your offer until they agree to sell to you. Okay. Let us begin then. Could you offer me a little more? I think it is worth a lot. Okay, I need to offer... I need to set a higher offering price. Let's make 60%. It's still a lot of money. Yes, between 50 and 70% of the base price is a good target. You will gain an item to sell without giving up too much money. So that's essentially how, to, how it goes. You seem to have a decent enough grasp of it. Well, let's put theory into practice. I will sell you several items. If you buy them from me successfully, I believe you will be ready to proceed. Let us begin. Hello, welcome to Racketeer. Tayaki. Oh, that's actually pretty delicious. Uh, what would what would you be willing to pay for this? Well, I don't think nothing is a proper response. Hey. Well done, let's do that once one more time. Is there another Tayaki? Because you seem to. No, chocolate bar. Yay, an excellent choice. Thank you so much. Very, very good. You are ready. If you ever wish to practice against... No. Hmm. I should probably... I'll see... All Most of the things up here are sold. Um, these are quite pricey. This is pretty pricey, too. Hmm. Oh, apples are rather expensive. Hey. 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 An old muffler. Oh, you have one. I really want one of these. Uh, that's way too much. Thank you. Yeah, just bonus. Plus 30. 
I wonder what my level actually does, though. I, I see a bar and I want to fill it. Welcome, looking for something special. Clothes, okay. Not a huge, like, amount of money. Glee, I sold clothes. Ooh, an old sword. A worn sword. The mother-in-law. Dude, your mother-in-law wants, like, all sorts of weapons. Actually, can I go a little higher? There we go. Yeah, 30. Is that gonna level me up? Level 3. Dude, I'm killing it. Welcome. Here, I think you'll like the, this. You know the business. I can't do it. Fantastic, that's a great Yeah, Hey, I scored cherry. Welcome, can I help you with anything? Hey, Louis. Oh, how much would this be? I thought you were poor, dude. Okay, look, you can see the defense up here. So this is going to affect how he plays. It'll add magic defense, but not decrease anything else. Actually, Louis, 700. Just combo plus 32. My goodness. I don't even know what's going on. I think combo is how many I sell in a row, obviously. But I think just might mean that I didn't have to haggle with him. Oh, little lady, how much for this? Well, I was hoping you'd see this. 109. Your pen. Just come up plus 64. Ah, oh, I was hoping to get the.